Gugu and her brother come from a single parent household raised solely by their mother who instilled a lot of great values in them while growing up. Gugu and her brother hardly experience the difficulties that comes with being raised by a single parent as their mother always practiced great parenting skills which resulted in fond childhood memories for her kids. Quoting, my brother and I would hide when my mother pulled in her car and she would come in and look for us. Upon finding us, she would tickle us and we would have the biggest laugh, said Gugu. Although Zanele has always been proud of her children, she did say that she would have loved for her kids to go for more, quoting, stable careers as that would have granted them consistent financial stability. However, the path Gugu has chosen as a career has shown Zanele that her kids were well in their right to choose the careers that they were passionate about. Quoting, but as I watched them progress, I realized that this was not what they wanted. Zanele had then decided to take Gugu to the best acting school, hence Gugu moved to the U.S. a couple of years ago to study drama. In 2014, Magwazam Sibi suffered a stroke, leading to her health deteriorating. Gumete told us this week that she desperately sought help everywhere, from doctors to prophets. She said the experience helped her to understand her character as Mamlambo. She was able to portray the character more realistically. Quoting, when my mother got sick, I was in between jobs. I don't really like to talk about it. I don't feel like it is my story to tell. It was difficult. Having a sick parent is not easy, but my acting coach said life problems are acting problems. Having a sick parent or anyone you love, you do things, you go crazy, search for whatever you can that you think may help. And having said that when my mom got sick, my family is not Umdeni or Joyele is Nyang, not a family that frequent, frequents traditional healers. My mom's battle was a spiritual battle that when I went crazy, I visited places, I went everywhere for help, she said. Quoting, I went to whoever I thought could help us. For her, it was more of traditional things. That was the first thing we had to do, to fight fire with fire, said Gomet. The family feared for the worst. Magwazam Sibi had a major heart surgery and doctors told the family to say goodbye as there was only 7% chances of her coming out alive. And if she did, there was 30% chances of her recovery. Quoting, I don't feel it was right for me to go there, but it helped me also for my character, Mam Lambo. Quoting, I am a born again Christian. I believe God works, God speaks and can heal. I was able to see another side of life where you transform into a spiritual aspect. It happened to us. It happened to my mother. My mom's story is so big and so amazing that one day she will be able to tell it and it will shock the nation. It's a beautiful testimony to see what God can do, said Gumete. Hi everyone, well my name is Gugu Gumete and this is my mom. <laughs> uh, this is the Honorable Zanel Makwazam Sibi who is an MP as well as the President of the National Freedom Party. Um, right now we're currently at our home doing what we always do. Uh, we love to just sit around and laugh and have fun and talk and pray. We pray a lot, yeah. We pray a lot, so we love to just sit and pray. And uh, today we basically just invited you guys to come and see what we do. Uh, when I'm not working, when I'm not acting in front of the camera, and when my mom is not busy um, in parliament or in meetings or running the world. This is what we do. We hope you guys enjoy this. Bye.